Yeah, but you hate it. You want a pizza, watch TV. I can tell. Oh my God, look. Like those kids who come through here all psyched and they have to bust ass and they're gone. Oh, and the potato disappeared. Like I have a fucking Holy choice. shit. What am I supposed this... to do? Oh, why? Maybe what, you chose what this What happened life? with this series, but I huh? didn't. Hey guys, Nukes Plays here and welcome to part two of my Life is Strange 2 episode three playthrough. Uh, last time we got shown a bit of where the two brothers are uh, with their new band of friends. And yeah, we all got on the car with this big Joe guy. So uh, I guess we're going to find out where that leads. And he seems kind of like a bit like he's an abusive spouse. Like everyone seems scared of him and he is in charge. And I can sense bad things coming, but I guess we'll see. Hey, little man. So at this point, you know, I'm like, whatever, dude, just Bye. give me more booze, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I don't bullshit you. Some gutter punk jump. You're not listening to anything I say. So I'm cutting it. Are you? Yeah. What? Jeez, yes, I am. Cut me too. The party. Oh, shit. Too much sex, guys. Are you okay? Too much sex. Shut up. <laughs> I was Two peas in a pod, these ones. I'll show you the battle scars. Oh, so high last night. Are you showing jealous? Cool. No way. You, you He's a big boy now. Got to get out okay. of his way. Smart. Yeah, if you get too clingy, people run away. I know what I'm talking hey, about. Who's the knife master I'm here? Guess. Did you lock the tent? You want to see stuff for showing him that even. So? Wrong. How do you feel? You went back for the lighter. Who knew this little tree market snowflake would end up here? <laughs> With us misfits. Well, Man, we I still feel like an outsider, this. you know? Why are you oh, you're doing great. Trust me. The meat fear. I was way worse than you when I joined the gang. Really? Please, don't hurt me. Looks like you found your place. Hey! I'm gonna shut the fuck up back there. I can't hear my music. Guess what? He was on his secret sat phone again this morning. Speaking Romanian and shit. Oh no. Here it comes. He's Agent 420. And he has a license to cook. <laughs> um, what's that? Told you a thousand times, Big Joe is a clone. They come from a factory in Silicon Valley. I knew there was going to be a big foot in this episode. <laughs> Maybe he's just the factory reject. Bigfoot. Think about it. Big Joe, Bigfoot. Whoa. <laughs> you might be on to something. They both smell. Stinky, Big Joe foot. <laughs> Shit, you're all in love with Big Joe. You can't stop talking about him, I swear. But his ass is too big. <laughs> what a bear, he's got a fat ass. <laughs> right <laughs> on. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> yep. It's <laughs> kind of a mystery. Hey, pipe down back there. Enjoy the scenery for a change, for fuck's sake. And yeah, it took so long on the, uh, the opening segment that it took us until the second part of episode three for us to even get the title intro and this thing here you can see in this little greenhouse is what we actually saw in the, the teaser for episode four uh which kind of alluded to sean and daniel hanging out with cassidy so we kind of knew this is where it was heading thanks to the, the post credits thing but uh yeah i'm so fucking tired Stop your bitching or get out of here. Hey! Jeez. We shall do nothing. Sir, yes, sir. We're a good little weed picker. Come on, Sean. We're gonna be late. Right. So he hires kids to do his weed stuff. Like, I'm not sure how it works. They have to, like, harvest it and... Like, pick it like strawberries or something? Like, how does this work? 
It's pretty cool visual though. Like I like it. Like you could see it in like a film. Like I know this is like meant to be like a mini TV series, but you know what I mean. Listen up. I need two teams today. Finn, Penny, Anders, and what your name will clean up the mess from the storm. Yeah. The rest of you get to sit and trim. Girls gotta sit in their asses while the males are outside? Yeah, right on. Like I wanna go pick up a bunch of shit all over the camp. Hey, you wanna trade places? Shut up, Daniel. You got a deal, kid. Yeah! I get to go outside. Hey! You guys still don't get it. This is work, not a goddamn summer camp. You're not special. There are dozens of hippies like yourselves begging for work at the next town. Kid, your dad should teach you to shut your mouth. Finn, you better watch your guys. Of course, boss. No problem. Okay, so move it. Yeah, you heard the man. Stop fucking around and get in your teams, all right? Hold up. You and me are gonna talk. Remember, I'm only letting you and your brother work here because Finn put in a good word. I know. We really appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. No ass kissing, please. Just watch out. Next time your brother fucks up, you're both gone ASAP. Look, I'm not trying to bust your balls. But this is a pot farm, and he's a fucking kid. You hear me? Got it. I'll keep him out of the way. You better. This business has enough shit already. What kind of shit? Jesus. What is this, an interrogation? Oh, uh, no. I'm sorry. Okay, time's up. Get the fuck out of here. You got a lot of work to do today. All right. Uh, thank you. All right, I'm not trying to be any, like, pot farmer expert here, but if you were kind of trying to keep your production line, let's say, like, carrying on smoothly, would you be hiring a bunch of, you know, people that are wanted and on the run? I don't think that's a very good business plan. Hey. You okay? Now for the fun part. I need this all done by tonight. No excuses. So, get on and it. I thought Daniel was gonna go outside, but I guess not. All right, we good? Eh, Finn is playing boss with his crew. I told them they'd all work late if they didn't finish on time. I hope so. Okay, I gotta make some calls. Well, what are you waiting for? You know the drill. <sighs> what? Dude, this sucks ass. I feel like I'm in prison. You look like you're in prison. Shh. Meryl almost kicked us out because of your big mouth. Meryl? Haven't heard that since Walking Dead. What part of Lilo don't you get? You shouldn't even be here. Sure. I bet you wish I wasn't here. Oh, stop. I can tell. You know exactly what I meant. Oh, I feel you, Daniel. Sometimes I get stir crazy in here too. Look, I know you guys are having the time of your life here, but I'm not. So shut your mouth and give me some quiet for fuck's sake, okay? Well, why do you stick around then? None of your damn business. <sighs> but I'd be long gone if I had the chance. Trust me. All right, man. Just pick a bud and get to it. So like I mentioned in the last episode, my like orientation thing is really goddamn bad for the graphics on screen so mine are like off to the right for some reason so mm -hmm. if i'm like what does that say and i can't read it then that's why mm -hmm. i don't know why i went on the settings there's like literally nothing to do about it although <laughs> it would be hilarious if this is like <laughs> three hours of just doing this shit man look at all these butts oh this is nothing last spring we were trimming about two or three pounds a day whoa that's a lot. Yep. Had to work overnight all the time. 
15 hours straight once. Yeah, <laughs> trying to forget. I was done with Kush after that. <laughs> Whoa, we are lucky. Right, and then your arms fall off. Fuck all that. This is like that mm. shitty like yoga mini game on GTA. So that's two. Uh. Is there anything to like look at or comment mm. on? Literally mm. nothing. Ah, fuck this. This game sounds bad, man. What is it? You got work to do. Mind your own business. <laughs> okay. Whatever, Mr. Grumpy. Jeez. Mr. Grumpy. It's called mustard party, okay? What? You're playing Mustard Party? Jeez, that's so cool. I used to be on the scoreboard. Cool, I don't care. <laughs> oh, Joseph, are you not on the scoreboard? Shut up, you got work to do. I should clean my scissors. They're a mess. Going too fast. Take your time, dude. Let's finish this uh, bud and then we can clean our scissors. This is so weird. This is such a weird fucking mini game. I did not think at the start of this I would be doing a mini game to cut up buds of weed. Clean scissors. Okay. Ouch! Shit. Ooh. You okay, sweetie? Sweetie. It's okay. You're doing fine. Just slow down if you need to. I know. I will. This is so weird. Thanks, Sean. <clears throat> Fuck off, I'm getting like super close with these, man. Yeah. Mm, my ass hurts. Oh my god, I can Fuck, relate to that, you know, when you sit in like a hard chair oh, for like a poor while. Baby. That's Damn. the job. Don't think. And like your just ass, work. like your okay. cock sick, so it's like just fucking. Don't ask killing. me to smile for the camera all day long. Poor Cassidy. You could be taking orders for fries and burgers. Uh, I don't think so. Then be glad you're here. There's like nothing to look at. Sean. Sean. Still with us? Uh, yeah. Sorry. Brain fart. Damn, Sean. We really need to do something about your hair. What? No, I love the hair. What, what's wrong with my hair? Are you kidding me? It's hiding your pretty face. I can't allow that. <laughs> Come on. It's not that bad. Just... Just a mess. Yes. But worry not. We've got everything to take care of it at the camp. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll see. <laughs> This is just really awkward. Like, I don't even know what to talk about here. I think the other thing uh. underneath the, the weed counter is like your scissor quality or scissor cleanness. But like, I can't really see it, so but I don't know. For real, though, if you could snap your fingers and go anywhere. Cassidy, we get it. Over and over. Hey, come on. You don't want to be here. Give me a break. I can't. So what? So I'm allowed to dream a little? You won't get hurt. <laughs> Promise. What about Louisiana? Must be so sweet this time of year. Uh, okay, man. Ah, uh, I'd love to visit New Orleans. Yep. Check out the voodoo shops and the blues band. <laughs> that would be cool. No. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Nobody's yeah. making you babies work here. No problem. You guys are all the same. Cool, let's be trimigrants. Then you barely work for a month. Oh, this is Yo, my life. Come here for a sec. <sighs> Shit. It's always something. <gasps> Do you know it would be awesome if, like, the farm got, like, raided? Damn. That would actually be pretty cool. Can you folks put a lid on it? We got shit to do here. Whoa, whoa. Damn. Easy for you to say, cowgirl. Some of us have to work. Please. I bust my ass like everybody else. I bet Sean wants to bust uh -huh. that ass. Don't even. You're always looking for an excuse. Ooh, it's 420. Hey, Sean, let's talk. Ow, my arm hurts. Wah, wah. Get off my crack, Hannah. 
We've been stuck out here for two months. I didn't come out to California to live on a fucking farm. I wanna see some water. Are we gonna squat out here forever? Build a house? What? Stop! You know we voted to stay for a while. Once it's legal, Just we ain't got no more job here. How's it going? Same as always. They want everything by tomorrow. Friday. This is so shit. I'm just over this place. Then go! Ugh. Take the fuck off. If we're a family, we stick together. You're on the bus, or off the bus. Thanks, Mom. Anything else? Yeah. <clears throat> but we don't have the time. Did you fall out of the wrong side of the tent, or what? That's not Shit. my problem, Joseph. You're clueless. You know the drill. Do your work. Yeah, sure. Fuck this shit. Hannah, sorry. I know. Hey, I don't want to fight. It's been a long, crappy week. Just keep it fucking down in here, okay? He's not very good at it, he's just completely missing everything. That was so weird. That's like one of them things you get in like them lists of like boring, unskippable game moments or something. Fuck. They're like, oh, we're trying to tap into the monotony of the life as a, uh, a crop farmer by making this really fucking boring mission. That was so lame. Cheer up, my little Sean. <laughs> Trust me, it's not as bad as you think. Other farms in the area is just straight down exploit your ass. You gotta be careful with those scissors. They're sharp as fuck. Yeah, no shit. Oh, you'll get scars, but you'll get it. <laughs> Part of the fun. Ain't sexier. Later, Big Joe. Smile, asshole. He has a mirror. So, did you have a good day at work, honey? Actually, kind of fun. Cass and Hannah cracked me up. They're like sisters. Sisters, <laughs> you wanna fuck? Yeah. They love to start shit with each other. Then get high. Short-term memory loss. How was your day? Did you have fun outside? <laughs> nope. Picked up branches and shit. Got covered in mud. Would not recommend. Still sounds better than sitting on your ass all day. I feel you, Sean. As always. That's why you're such a good fit for the family. You totally hooked us up. A job. Cash. Friends. Safety. John, everybody's cool with you two. <laughs> Daniel is your secret weapon. I don't know. He's way too young for this bullshit. You gotta be zen about this. The more you try and control him, the less you have. It's deep, huh? Swear, he acts just like me. <laughs> That's how I know he's smart. He's also got a kick-ass hermano. <laughs> yeah. My brothers are like that. So, what's your story? Um, I mean, you don't have to tell me, but... Yeah, I was pretty lucky. My parents were okay. <laughs> I had three big brothers who spoiled me. Aw, <laughs> you were the baby boy? Like Daniel. <laughs> but my family was kind of... Mm, messed up. My dad was like a front for hot cars. Yeah. He'd steal, strip, and sell them. My brothers and I helped him. You know, typical shit. Till we got 
busted. <laughs> Fucking feds wanted me and my brothers to testify. <laughs> but my dad narked on us instead. Damn, Finn. That sucks. Uh, <laughs> what happened? I went to jail. When I got out, I was like, well, how old is he? Shouldn't he be like a body in juvenile? <laughs> so I hit the road, Jack. And anyways, I found a cooler family out here. You know, I love traveling, checking out new things. Yeah, never gets old. <laughs> well, going to Mexico is the ultimate road trip. If we make it there, dude. Who knows? It's pretty scary. So fucking far. Hey, hey it is. Uh, but you have time and a strong, uh, damn it, uh, will. Yeah. N nothing can stop you from going there. Uh, it will be all right, Sean. Don't worry. Okay. Therapy's over. Oh, yeah. I gotta move those water tanks for the shower and stuff. It's cool you're doing your part, huh? Finally. Glad I can help. So, Hannah, how long ago did you come here to Humboldt for work? Nine years. I love Santa So, Bay should we go to the bench help. or should we talk no to money, Cassidy? Nobody. It's north. Before we do our farms, jobs. Learn how to trim. Just head over here first. Tried to attack me up in Arcata. Although Daniel's over there as well, so. That is awful, Hannah. I almost killed that fuck, but I came back to Humboldt. That was quite cool. That was a cool transition. I had this sweet deal with Meryl. It is nicer here than other places we saw. Too many junkies and homeless. They go together sometimes. No home. Get high. What the fuck else are you gonna do on the street? Clean it up. We see so much trash in the forest around here. California is very green, but starting to look like shit. Not everybody has time to fucking recycle or compost their shit, especially when you live off the grid. We all should try. It's everybody's planet too. Sweden is not perfect. Yeah, have we you seen try Midsummer? To be more eco-conscious. We only have one. Planet. I mean, I haven't, but I think that's where it is. Not for long. It's true. We gotta do something. That's what we're saying. Blah, fucking blah. Taurus talking shit again. Like you guys have it so hard. We did not say that we did. Tell me again how many hours you spent on a plane during your awesome trip around the world, and then you come crying about hobos spreading garbage in the forest? Good point. Now you're here sponging off us trash on an illegal pot farm with a tourist visa. Lecturing us. Funny, right? Hannah, I'm sorry. We were not trying to lecture you. We are grateful we found that job and that we let Just us Just like stay Mary Poppins' fucking guys. bucket of potatoes. I know. We're cool. Do you hate us now? You're funny. Don't worry. You'd know if I hated you. All I care about is my family right here. These three gutter punks. The rest, none of my business. Not used to peeling potatoes, huh? A lot of work. I know how to cook. Just not everything yet. Yeah, but you hate it. You want a pizza, watch TV. I can tell. Oh my god, look. Like those kids who come through here all psyched and they have to bust ass and they're gone. Oh, and the potato disappeared. Like I have a fucking Holy choice. shit. What am I supposed <laughs> this... to do? Oh, why? Maybe what, you chose what this happened life? with this series, I man? Didn't. I know, I know. Her we funny was just like producing own. potato peelings. I just fucking hate phonies. Too many here. Crusty backpack doesn't make you one of us. Well, what do I gotta do to pass initiation? Don't be a pussy. Stand up for us. You can't be part of our family unless you open up. This is a family too. Not a pit stop. Out in the wild, sharing is caring. You should go a brown tooth. I hear you, but my brother comes first. Always. That's good. Shows you're not a selfish prick. That way too many. It's very intense, just like sitting next to each other and just like directly glaring at one another. So, how did you hook up with the others? 
Met Finn, had some squat when he got out of jail. Young punk, but old soul. We just clicked. Then we ran into Cassidy a year ago. Pissed at everything. Hurt, unable to commit to anything, except us. Then Pennywise found us, here in Humboldt, tripping about his friend Jinx. But you know, he just fit in. Now we're all pretty fucking tight. Hell yeah you are. Hell yeah it's you are tight. awesome. You don't have to tell me, but how did you end up on the road? My community was a mess. Too much wasted talent. My mom, she was an artist and a drunk. Tried to get her into rehab countless times. Worked my ass off to buy her paint and stuff. Until I realized she was just returning everything to Z-Mark to get the cash back to buy her booze. I just knew I had to get the fuck out before that curse would get me too. I'm glad you're at peace now. Sounds rough, man. So, are you satisfied with your life now? I'm grateful for what I have, yeah. Not everything is perfect, but we got balance, prospects. That's way more than I had before. Thanks for taking the time to talk, Hannah. That's cool. Yeah. Anyway, didn't mean to grill you, Sean. It was a long day. So she's kind of like a passive-aggressive tomboy. Actually, I don't even know if it's passive-aggressive, just aggressive, maybe. Whoa. Hannah's tough to figure out. Don't fuck with her. Did we look at the redwood before? What do you say about it? It's a big tree. I do love these trees. Ancient and majestic. You haven't done any drawing in this one. I thought you might have done some woodage. Oh, it's his girl. Hey. Hola. <laughs> que esta señor? <laughs> oui, oui. Estás ensayando para la voz? Uh... Bonjour. No comprendo. <laughs> Don't laugh. Still learning, professor. Hmm, <laughs> professor. At least you're trying. Hey. We know what she's into. Am I bugging you? <laughs> Never. But let me finish this new song before I forget it. Don't let me get in the way. Talk later. Well, fuck, she fucked us off. She's so natural. I wish I could be more like that. Socializing is hard. We're whittling away. What up? Whittled away. Uh, the usual. Carving some wood. Yeah, we've all been there, my man. I learned wood carving with an Inuit native back when I lived in Alaska. He's the kind of guy that I hate it's so an much. Technique. Helps me vent out and focus. Yeah, I just let my hands sculpt the wood. And Do I sculpt the wood? Sometimes I have good surprises. Or does the wood sculpt me? <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. It's actually a cool cowboy thing I've been trying to do for a while, but I, I suck at this. It's just fun to relax. It is fun to relax, yes. Okay, that was great talk as well. Finn is too punk rock to be a farmer. All right, I'm guessing we're gonna have to do some jobs now. And I think Daniel's, yeah, he's still over there. Probably washing the same plate he was doing before. These guys know how to make a bong out of pretty much anything. And now I do too. Anyone seen my face? Okay. Oh, a group picture. Aw, they look so cute here. Hmm, cute's one word for it. I love how they're like a real family. All right, let's go and talk to our brother. I guess, if we must. Almost done. Need two more hands, Dishmaster? Uh, yeah. That'd be cool. I'm on it. So boring. Yeah, I don't miss doing the dishes. Then why are we doing Because we're a family. That 
that's it. Finally. Yeah, finally, the five seconds of washing you dishes. Need a hand God. with your own chores? That'd be awesome. I need help moving the water tanks to the shower and kitchen. Okay. Are we not doing the bins? I'll wait for you near the water tank so we can take on those barrels. Right, so barrels are where? Because I know the shower is somewhere as well. Yes, I know. Go fill the water tanks. I have one job. Here's a shower. And so we need the water tanks. Where are these tanks? There they are. Let's have a look in here. Look at this one shining in there. She's got a giant diamond. Okay. Hello, Dolly. You're old. A pile of books. Oh, is this the neat guy? Jacob. Shit. Is it Jacob? I don't know. Hmm. Wow, they look intense. Wonder who's her mom? And who's the other woman? So cool he carries this around. Wish I could see the pictures he took of us. We'll have a look through his bag. I'm sure he's... Must be tough to I'm be surprised so he hasn't had a look through his, his bag to, to find some pictures in that case. Happy birthday, Sarah. I'm sorry I can't be there to eat all your cake and open all your presents. Oh, cake, fuck. Hope you have a fun party with your mum and dad and your friends. I can't wait to see you again and show you all my cool pictures of California. I'll call when I get the chance to sing happy birthday. Three hearts, your brother Jake. Beautiful. He, uh, his writing, if you look at it, is a lot like uh, the Roald Dahl kind of so scribbling you get. That's quite interesting. Oh, a tie. Weird. Where did he get that from? Ooh, that was kind of sinister. Where did he get that from? There should be a lot more, like, mystery stuff going on in these. Oh, I think I will miss it here. Same. But we can't resist the wanderlust. Plus, Portland's waiting for us. Oh, they're going to Oregon. <sighs> I think I'll take a nap. Me too. I'm exhausted after Their conversations today. are fantastic. Damn. Trimming is hard. How do these guys keep coming back? All right, let's go and get some water tank action done then. Pick up. Oh, you have to tap it, okay. Let's get these over to the kitchen and shower. Where's thingy gone one step i forgot you time, could use the uh, the left bumper frame to help so i guess because i forgot that i'm fucked that's not fair penny's all over the place he'll go anywhere i think it's behind this tree here i'm hoping oh wait we're gonna put it here are we put down I like that, like, ghost water tank that they put there. Maybe Daniel will be back. Where is he? Where is he? I don't know. You press left bump, it just, like, fucks off over here. I wasn't very focused on the trim today. No shit. Guess we'll see you tomorrow. Payday. This is stupid. See, I don't like this kind of shit. It's like, it's not like a big deal, like at all, but I just like it when you can kind of go back if you've made a like tiny Let's carry mistake. carry that one to the shower. Like he shouldn't just like disappear. It should be like, oh, are you sure you want to do that? Cause I'm sure like, us doing the tanks together would kind of increase our like bond thing because it's kind of up and down lately gotta put that one near the shower i know you do oh there's a squirrel that's cool maybe we can like draw that or 
I was going to say take a picture, but that was just the first one. That's sad. Easy I used to enjoy that. You had to like set up the scenarios where you could yeah, take a picture. Right. That was fun. This is a shower, right? It's, where's my Where's my ghost? Oh, there you go. And my ghost of water tank. There you are. Reminds me of um, Murdered Soul Suspect, like that kind of sheen that it had to it. Interesting game. I don't know if I'd recommend it, but it's definitely not terrible. I, th I think it's interesting. That's one way to put it. I wonder what they all say. Living large and humble. Humboldt, California. I've never heard of that before, to be fair. Uh, now what do we do? Oh, can we do anything with that squirrel? See if it's still running around. Those guys sure know how to live outdoors. They've taught me so much already. Okay, I guess we can't do anything with that squirrel. Uh, where are we going? What are we doing? Okay, maybe she's finished her song. Nope, she's still just playing it. Where's our tent? Oh, this is our tent. Sit and draw. Okay, there you go. I thought it'd be about time for some drawing. We've got to draw Cassidy, of course, because we'll have to impress her. With our artist, artistic vision. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw Oh, this. penmanship. Actually, that's writing or something, isn't it? Okay, and look down. So yeah, same as last time, all you do is you look like up and Cassidy's you hold it, and then you look down music. and you wiggle the stick in a circle. If only it was that easy. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. And he says the same thing every time, time you think they like, dude. change it like a tiny bit, possibly. Wow, okay, that came into focus. Bo! <laughs> What are you drawing? And you are so uh, focused nothing. When you draw. That's cute. You should yeah. have drawn Hannah's tits from earlier. Thanks. <laughs> that may be the judge. Whoa, whoa, give it back. Please, Cassidy, do not even look. Whoa, down boy. Really, Sean? I didn't mean to freak. <laughs> Stop this tortured artist shit. Share it. Come on. So you tell me, like, she didn't manage to look at it when she had it in You're her hand. Good. She's looking at it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I look happy. Like, I belong here. <laughs> I love how you see me, Sean. I think I look cooler as a sketch. Really? You think it's okay? <laughs> no, I'm just being nice. If it was bad, you would know. I don't lie. Well, I could never draw like that. What's your secret? People like you. <laughs> I don't know. I just get inspired by the things I see and do. And uh, being around people like you helps. Wow, he's so smooth. So I'm um, like your muse. Sweet. <laughs> well, Why don't uh, you come be my concubine? You're a great model. Yeah. Oh, don't make me blush. We all learn from each other. Right? Well, That's I'm sure you I could teach me a thing or right two. Finally. <laughs> yeah, but we don't always have to suck up to fuckers like Meryl. Most of the years, I don't know. Us. Maybe sucking the isn't always bad. Where's his smooth lines? What do you miss about your old life? Anything? Besides some friends? Nothing. Well, my own bathroom. <laughs> Out here, you see that you don't need all that bullshit they sell. Huh. That's freedom. I mean, the trick in this country is just to survive. I guess. I do like traveling around, but I want a base. Will you ever go back to Texas? No fucking way. My daddy was a meth head who beat the shit out of my boyfriend just because he wasn't wet yep then my big brother told me 
he would shoot me if I dated, dated that, well, you know, my mom didn't say spot, as usual. Thanks, mom. So, fuck them all. This is my family now. Damn, I'm sorry, Cassidy. <laughs> ah, don't be. I feel sorry for them. Well, I'll go heavy quick. So, tell me. What do you miss about your old life? <laughs> Everything. Because I didn't appreciate shit when I had it. Like, just waking up at night to get a bowl of fucking Squeaky Knacks cocoa. Squeaky Knacks? <laughs> oh my god. I used to eat those too. You always think it's gonna be there. They're getting fucking ridiculous with these naming of brands. Stupid stuff like that. But... Things change, right? Yep, so keep moving forward. You have a good heart, Sean. I think you could use some alone time. See you later. <laughs> so do you reckon if we like go in our tent, is that gonna be like the end of this section? I feel like we've done everything we can. Okay, we can only look at it. That's cool they let us use their extra gear. We lucked out. Okay, so what the fuck are we actually meant to do now then? Oh, we meant to go to the lake, weren't we? Which I think is not this way. Okay. Time to help Daniel do some power training. He's waiting at the lake. And it's this way, following the lake. That makes sense. Daniel's waiting for me. Oh. I should go meet him. Okay, I guess it was back the other way then. Ah, the sign saying late. In a week or two, we'll have enough to buy our way through the border. What are these strange markings? Words. Ah, words. Scooby Doo 2 represent up in this bitch or whatever the kids say nowadays. YOLO, TikTok. Look at that, that's like a fucking cool view. Even if, oh no, I was going to say, he is, even if he's a statue, but he's, he's moving around. <laughs> Sweet. But can you do it without your power? Oh yeah. I can do better with my own skills now. Next level. Onward. Ready to rumble? Fucking A. Fucking A. Let's start with our team how. T.S. Lobos. Ow, ow, ow. Still sound okay. Now let's do this. Come on. Hold up. Too many people over there. Let's hit the other side. Well, even after he's already sent a fucking rock over across the other side of the lake. Okay. Oh, it's left trigger. Hey, can you move that tree trunk? Duh. So I was meant to help, ask him to help me with them water tanks, but I forgot. And kills me as I go, no, it's fuck! <laughs> Your face! Come on, I wasn't gonna drop it on you. Very funny, man. Okay. Let's have yes, there's too many people by that camp, so what we should do is we should walk about two feet to our left, 
and then you can pick up a giant fucking tree. Alright, got some stones and some mushrooms. Let's go for these stones first. Uh, think you can lift all those? I know I can. Wow, very impressive. You can pick up some pebbles. It was quite pretty, like them, like kind of trailing in the water. Whoa, Daniel, that's a, that's amazing. I told you I rule. All right, let's see what he does with these mushrooms then. Bet Train it's different destruction. Here in the Penny said it gets crazy crowded. People everywhere. Yeah, that's why we can train out here now. Precision. Okay, no we're doing like different aspects. I get it. Pick a rock. Any rock. Okay. And. Let's test your aiming system. Target in sight. Locked and loaded. Okay, we're gonna guess we're gonna have to throw them again for some reason. And bye bye, pinecone. Awesome. Okay, you're good. Now let's spice things Ooh, up. Ooh, spicy! Two pine cones. Holy shit! That was not a fair fight. That's right. What's next? Is that all you got? Uh, is there any other option? Our destruction? It looks like it. So I guess we're going to do some destruction training. Which might be a bad idea in the long run. We'll see how that pans out hmm. for us. Let's try this. I want you to focus on these ugly mushrooms and blow them apart. Mushrooms are pretty ugly, Dude, to be fair. I'll blow the shit out of that. Waiting, or maybe you. What the? <laughs> that was some next level shit, Daniel. Thanks. I've been training on my own sometimes. Oh, have you now? I know I haven't been around a lot lately. You didn't tell anyone. Did you? No way. Why would I? Not even Cause you're a stupid kid. No. Jeez. You don't even trust me. Whatever. What's wrong with you, man? I don't like this new emo Daniel. <laughs> it's true. You keep throwing your attitude at me for no reason. Sick of it. Am I a bad big brother? Because I hang out with other people. You're always with them. That sucks. Oh, come on, Daniel. Bet you don't even want me around anymore. Don't say that. You know it's always you and me and I know. I mean, never mind. That's it, enough. You're being a brat. You can't say anything without you having a shit fit. A shit fit, that's cool. Like quick fit, but with shit. We still have a long way to go. Or a fit bit. And we have to go together, right? I know it sucks. But you have to grow up now. Hey ya! Make a whirlpool like the mummy too when it's got his face in it. Stop it! Stop it, Daniel! No!
That was pretty cool how you just like walked off and it was falling in the background. Okay, that was quite a long one. Longer than I expected it to be uh, and planned on it being. So we'll call it a day for part two of episode three. So we'll drum next time where we kind of see the fallout of uh, their relationship and see what's going on a bit more. And hopefully I'll see you guys next time where we continue with series two, episode three, Wasteland. So thanks for watching. Stay awesome. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks a lot, guys. Mm -hmm.